Hello friends, welcome to a new drug today. Uh, in this drug, uh, this is the ninth drug. I'm sorry, this is the ninth drug which I'm discussing today. This is atropine. So, what are we going to learn about atropine? Atropine, the pa parenteral dose of atropine is 0 0.6 to 1.2 milligrams. Uh, then what are the indications of this atropine? The major indications are one, it is used in organoph organophosphorus poisoning. It can be used in organophosphorus poisoning. The second use is it can be used in dysmenorrhea. And then and also intestinal colic it can be used in dysmenorrhea and intestinal colic it can be used in complete heart block then fourth use it can be used as pre anesthesia fifth it can be used in midriasis and cycloplegia can be used as in midriasis and cyclo cycloplegia and sixth it is used for ophthalmoscopic administration examination ophthalmoscopy okay seventh use it is used as an antidote to neostigmin mainly in myasthenia gravis okay so this is about neostigmin now what are the contraindications sorry as atropine contraindications of atropine atropine is contraindicated in glaucoma it is contraindicated in enlarged prostate then psychosis it is contraindicated in psychosis and also pyloric uh, stenosis and paralytic ileus then what about the side effects of atropine side effects is anticholinergic drug so it has correct opposite it has dry mouth palpitations are seen there can be retention of urine. Okay. There can be blurring of vision or psychosis, which is called as atrophin psychosis. It also precipitates glaucoma. So these are the different features of atropine. So thank you guys for watching my lecture. Thank you.